Hello and welcome to Tim Cade. So, it's been a little while since I've posted, I'll admit. And in this episode, what we're going to be doing is we are going to be doing what I am calling the Tim Cade Simulator Showdown. And it's where I'm going to do a tier list, which I am going to show here, uh, of simulator games that I have in my Steam account from good ones, such as uh, Gas Station Simulator or City Skylines, to the bad ones like Woodcutter Simulator 2013. And we're going to go through and we're going to try these out and we're going to rank them on, a, on a, a typical tier level. So S, A, B, C, D. The first one that we're going to start with is one that I just purchased and I wanted to play. So I figured we'd play it together. Why not, right? So let's play some Cooking Simulator. Cooking Simulator is, uh, as the name implies, a simulator game where you are running a kitchen uh, for a restaurant and making food for people. It should be very, very interesting to see how this goes. I've watched some gameplay of it in the past, and it was quite entertaining. At the end of this episode, we will put it on our list uh, and rank it from S to D. S being the top tier, superlative, supreme, excellent games, uh, which I would recommend highly, all the way down to D, which you should probably just avoid forever. Now, we're gonna go ahead and start, ooh, I'm sorry, I hit the microphone with my hand. I'm flailing around like you can see me. Sigh, it's been a week. First thing we're gonna do is just check our settings, make sure everything looks okay. We're gonna put everything on ultra because yeah, why not? Okay, uh, it wants me to reset the game. You know what, screw it, we're not gonna do that. We're just gonna play it as is. Let's do a new game and play some cooking simulator. So there's pizza is uh, uh, a DLC. There's Cakes and Cookies, which is a DLC. Tons of DLCs here. There's Career Mode, Cooking School, the Learn to Walk. Um, we're just going to throw ourselves into Career Mode and just see what happens. But uh, there's other DLCs like Cooking with Food Network, Winter Holidays, which I guess is a freebie, and the Super Hot Challenge, which Super Hot's a great game as well. But anyways, that said, let's go ahead and start with career mode and see how bad we do. We're going to aim for, we're going to go for a modern kitchen. We're going to aim for uh, about 30 to 45 minutes of gameplay. We'll see how much we, we can cram into here uh, and then we'll make our, our initial decision. Um, these are the kind of games that I've been playing a lot of lately. I've been playing a ton of simulator games. Um, I mentioned Gas Station Simulator. I probably have put like like 20 or 30 hours into that. I just could not stop playing it and I've just about beaten the story part of it quite fun uh, and I'll, I'll i'll do a little bit of a, a showcase of that one later on down the road in this simulator showdown all right welcome to the kitchen welcome to cooking simulator as you've already noticed the restaurant you're now employed in does not have the greatest rating your task is to restore it to its former glory and reach the highest level of prestige the last chef left the kitchen covered in sticky notes maybe they'll be of some use to you good luck okay well here's our kitchen it's actually quite a nice kitchen Ooh, look at that view Heck yeah, bro. That's nice. All right, so we got tomatoes. We got lemons. Um, We got onions. We got potatoes. We got potatoes. Try not to go bankrupt. Almost everything in the kitchen costs money, plates, products, and especially repairs. Don't take more than you need and keep an eye on your balance. We have 749 credits. Once you're out of money, you're out of business. Okay. Um. Um. Can I... I don't, I don't want it though. I don't. Okay, so middle mouse button is how you throw something. Let's put that there. Okay, let's take a look around here. Um, we got NIFs, we got our stove top. What we got in here? Nothing of value. Uh, we got a timer. Um, all right, uh, we got ourselves a fryer basket. Okay, uh, let's put it down. Won't let me put it down. Stick that in there. Um, fill with oil or drain. Neat. That's our swingy, swingy thingy. Uh, let's see, what do we have? Do we have pots and pans? We have a spatula. We have ovens, and that's how we're delivering our food, I suppose. Not sure what these do if they even do anything yet, but um, yeah, neat. We're getting there. 
So is there like a thing that I can do to order something? All right, so we got our, our pro cutter. We got our really cool microwave. We got our ovens, neat, with timers on them. We got a bake tray. Okay. Um, I don't know what this is. We're just going to skip the prep phase because I have no idea what I'm doing. Look, someone ordered a dish. Every time a client orders something, you'll be notified in the upper left corner of the screen. Notifications will also appear when you have only a minute left to complete a dish. You're slightly late or when a client gives up waiting and goes home to work then. Okay, so I need salmon, steak, and boiled potatoes. Okay, so let's go ahead and bring our pan over here and let's put this down there. And we got a blender. Okay, I need slamming salmon. So let's see what we got in the fridge here. That's trout. That's a salmon filet. So let's buy that. And uh, let's put that down for now. Let's go. Let's go close the the fridge so we don't let our stuff rot. We're gonna grab a nice sized plate, a large plate. Ah, shit. <laughs> That was not what I intended to do. I broke it. I broke the plate. Okay, well, that was way easier than I was expecting it to be to break something. So let's turn this on. I think that's going to be the far right one. And we, what do I need to do? Salmon, steak, and boiled potatoes. So I need a pot. I got to fill that with water. So where's my sink? Do I get a sink? Where the hell's my sink? Oh, there's my sink. So let's go ahead over here. Let's stick this in there and fill it up. I don't know how to cook anything, though. I mean, I, I cook things normally in real life, but I don't I don't I just don't know. So let's let's get this boiling. Is there like instructions or. I, I just don't I just don't know. I wonder if the computer will tell me. Recipe manager. Uh, steak and boiled potatoes. Take salmon filet, 210 grams, season with salt, black pepper, add to the pan sunflower oil and the salmon filet, 60 seconds on each side. 1,000 milliliters of water. I went a little over with that. Salt, 20 grams. Potatoes, 300 grams. Boil. Okay. So let's go, let's go here, and then I think all I got to do is just... Wish there was a way that I could like, oh, uh, here we go. No? Is there a way that I can make that like on my screen permanently? Anything? No? That's odd. Um, okay, let's close that. So I need oil, sunflower oil. Let's go find some oil. All right, we got oil. Let's not whip it around too hard here. Put some oil there. Let's find that break. I thought I heard something break. Where's the salt? That's horseradish. Salt. Okay. And let's find some pepper. I see why they give you a uh, preparation phase. <laughs> um... Okay, let's put that down directly on there. Um, okay, so let's double check what we had here. So we have to do um, 1,000 milliliters, 20 grams of salt, and 300 grams of potatoes. Oh my god. My memory's really bad, y'all, so... Um... Okay, so we need 20 grams of salt, 300 grams of potatoes. Okay, so 20 grams of salt. Okay, and 20 grams of potatoes. Or 300 grams of potatoes, sorry. Are those potatoes down there? Nope, those are lemons. What was that? Potato. Uh, 
Um, okay. That's one. I wish I could carry multiples. I don't understand quite how to do all that yet, but we'll find out, I suppose. Put another one in there. Set a timer. Four, two. Oh, okay. Four. That's seconds. Two minutes. Okay. Put that down. Okay, next I need to figure out what I got to do for my salmon filet, which is going to be, this is just like cooking, you know, five grams of salt, five grams of pepper, 10 milliliters of sunflower oil. So, so five salt, five pepper, 10 milliliters sunflower oil. Okay, there's the salt, there's the pepper. 10 mils. Oh God, I went way overboard with that. My B. And we slapped the salmon filet on there. Boop. Think that's running. So when that hits uh, there is when we'll flip it. 60 seconds on either side. Taste. We're almost there. Okay. Um, ro rotate. How do I? Ah. Oops, nope, that's not what I wanted. Ah, shoot. Uh, put that back. <laughs> it's hot. It's too spicy. How do I flip it? Oh, I need the spatula. Damn it. Give me the spatula. <laughs> this is chaos. Uh, uh, ro rotate. Nope. Um, rotate. Ah, okay, there we go. Cool. Okay, um, let's sit this back down. Where can I put this? Yep, just sit there. Sit there for now. Let's taste it. Oh, shit. Oh, man. I spilled all that oil. Uh, I don't want it to burn. Let's put some oil in there. Okay, sit that back down. How are we looking here? Um, okay, let's take the pot off. Um, how do I, how do I scoop those? Do I have a spoon or something? Oh my goodness. I'm so disorganized. I don't know how any of this works. Uh, let's see. Is there a spoon, um, that I can use for flippage or something like that? I, I just don't know. How do I get them out? Uh... Um, <laughs> how's that looking? I just, I don't know what I'm doing, bro. I just don't know. Okay, let's try that. Okay, the salmon filet is cooking again. <sighs> then we'll plate it. I just need to figure out what the Hello Kitty I'm doing, ultimately. Um, this can go off. Hopefully there's no other order. Uh, let's add... Okay. Almost done. As soon as this finishes. Come on, baby. Um, rotate. There we go. Oh, Jesus. Pick that back up. 
That's really disorienting and hard to see. Okay, uh, sit you back down. Um, how do I get the potatoes out? Oh, Jesus! Uh, sink. Yeah, all right. Um... Uh, don't put it down. How do I... I need to... Advanced controls. Rotate. So hold this. How do I... How do? I, how did I do that, though? How did I pour this? No, stop. No, bad. Um... I don't... I don't know. I need a spoon. Help! I need a spoon. Help me. <laughs> There's no spoons in any of these cabinets. I just don't know what's happening. This game is great. Oh my goodness. Oh, I love this. I just, I need a spoon, bro. How do I order a spoon? Can I order something here? Is there a skill? Do I need to do perks? Like how, how, how? Ay, ay, ay. There's gotta be a spoon somewhere. There's no, like, knives or forks or anything, bro. Here we go. Utensils. A colander. Yes. Buy. Okay. Let's put the colander in here. No. Bad. <laughs> I just don't know. Um, no, don't throw it. Damn it. I didn't know that threw it away. F my life. <sighs> tongs. Buy some freaking tongs, dude. That should do the trick. Yes. Let's bring this here. Let's sit it down. Let's grab the dang tongs. No. Yes, tong those things. E. Yes. Oh, God. <laughs> okay, I need you to go, like, right there. And I need the tongs. And I need to scoop this. And it goes here. There we go. Beautiful. Order up. That's trash. How do I how do I order up here? Order up. <laughs> Serve that dish. Two minutes late. Sorry, bro. Holy crap. <laughs> that is so difficult. I made some money though. Does it tell me how much that cost? Okay, I got some cooking points. Okay, so, um, let's, let's dump this. So, advanced controls, oh god, oh Jesus. Okay, let's sit you back down, and let's turn this off, and now let's, uh, let's sit this back down here. Okay, <laughs> I'm doing great, y'all, I'm doing great. Okay, so next recipe is baked trout. So I'm sure we're going to need some trout. I think we're going to need lemons. How's this one work? Okay, so trout. Season with black pepper, thyme, and dill. Bake for 90 seconds. All right, so I'm going to need the baking tray. So let's bring out the baking tray. Bring out your dead. Sit that down. Let's go grab our trout. We need dill. We need, I think it's that horseradish, and we need thyme. God, I wish I could sprint. Uh, that's thyme. Okay. Set this down. Let's go grab a trout. We know where those are. They're right here. Buy a trout. Shut the door. Put our trout down. Okay. Now, um, we need to... Five grams of black pepper, thyme, and dill. Sit you down. Thyme and dill.
Okay. Now... Place on a baking tray, bake for 90 seconds. Okay, so I need lemon quarters. Oh my god. Garnish with parsley leaves. Okay, so I need parsley and I need lemon. I know where the lemon is. Let's grab the lemon. Quarter of lemon. All right, let's sit this down there. And let's close you up. And then I need thyme or whatever uh, the garnish was. This parsley leaves. Okay, cool. Fresh parsley. We're just going to sit you down for now. So the first thing I need to do is I need to put this in a baking tray uh, for 90 seconds. Cut lemon into quarters. Okay. We need to bake for 90 seconds. So we go for one minute. And we're going to go for a minute 40 and sit it down. And then we're going to stick this in the tray. Oh, no. Ah, oh, Jesus. <laughs> My fish went flying. Um, They don't have to know. They just they don't have to know. OK, we'll be a little more careful, a little little more uh, focused. OK, now let's see if we can chop this into quarters. Yeah. Oh my god, this is ridiculous. Okay, as good as we're going to get it there. So let's put this back in the in the block. Um and I need a plate, right? Uh So I need those and then I need fresh parsley leaves. Okay. So let's go grab a plate. <laughs> grab this. Not break it. Sit you down. We will put our lemon quarters here. Oh, God. Nope. Put that back. That cutting board stays in place. Thank you very much. I am a professional. Thank you. Shoot. That's almost done. So, what are the advanced controls? Uh, here we go. Uh, drop. Boop. Beautiful. So let's move this and put that there. Put this here. We want that trout right in the dead center. Drop that. And drop that. Yep. Okay, uh, tongs. Where's my tongs? That tong to tong tong tong. Whoa. All right. Oh, I didn't want to drop the tongs. All right, we're going to sit you down. Okay, stop. Stop that. Okay. And then, uh, I need to season this uh, with horseradish. How much horseradish do I need to put on there? Damn it, I don't know the recipes! Five grams. All right, horseradish. Go, go, go. All right. Let's go. One, two, three, four, five. Oh, did I? Did only a certain... Oh, man. I didn't season it well at all. Oh, I didn't realize you had to put it directly on it. Oh, crap. All right. Nice and slow. Delivered. Serve it up, baby. That's the one. Oh, hell yeah. That's much better. I'm getting the flow of this. This is starting to make sense. This game is, uh, ridiculous. Um, how do I clean up is the big question. <laughs> Ugh. What are the advanced controls? Rotate. 
All right, that seems to be doing nothing. Ugh. Um, yeah, I'll just let that go. That's about how I feel. <laughs> All right, uh, I think it was T to continue. I think I'm done. So how do I leave for the day? Small pot. Um, how do I mark myself as done for the day? Um, is there a radio? Interesting. Okay. Um, how do I leave? Okay, it's a cleaning phase, and I don't know how to clean. Did I leave this on? I did. Shame on me. Um, where are my cleaning supplies? <laughs> Beer? Nice. A sponge. Can I use a sponge? Buy a sponge. Can I use that to clean up? Clean. <gasps> Neat. Oh, that's 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 pretty nice. That's real nice. Okay, cool. Clean. Aha. Back. Uh, clean. Do 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 do. Oh yeah. Clean all of this up. Clean. Well, that's unfortunate. I got caught back there. <laughs> okay. Clean. Aha. Back. A clean kitchen is a happy kitchen. Set this down. Hey, we're getting there. Let's put this back. At least I don't have to... Do I have to do the dishes or anything? Yeah, I do. Um, pick up. Let's uh, clean this. Oh my lord, I just do not know how this works. Uh... Is it all cleaned off now? Maybe? I hope. Good lord, I hope it's clean. Okay, that cleaned it. Um, yeah, I need to clean off the pan. And back, and then we do advanced controls. We rotate and dump it in there. Nice and clean. Heck yeah. I don't know if I have to clean anything else though, so I think we're okay in that regard. So let's uh, let's sit down our let's put our let's hang our spatula right behind us, shall we? Oh, all done then. Okay. Ooh, new perks available. That's nice. I'm going to uh, turn it up a little bit because it's a little quiet, in my opinion. Right back to it. All right. Choose a perk. So get three skill points instead of unlocking a perk. Steady hands. Hold down shift to freeze items in place while cutting. Uh, unbreakable plates. Plates will never break. Heatproof gloves. Pick up and carry hot ingredients in your hands. Longer reach when picking up and putting down items. Space to walk faster. Magic wand that removes all stains and shards. Unbreakable bottles. Let's do fairy touch first. And I got three skill points, so let's see. More cooking points from served dishes, quest rewards, experience points. Uh, let's do cheaper products. Level that up. Let's do cheaper liquids and do cheaper recipes. Start the next day. Day two. Now this, this is fun. All right, let's do one more day, and then we can call it... Uh, a fair uh, quits for the day. 
Um, spilled some water, so let me grab my sponge. Oops. Clean that up. And clean that up. Okay. That's satisfying. And uh, let's see what our re recipes are right now. So we got tomato soup. We've got the, the trout, or the salmon steak and boiled potatoes, and we have the baked trout. Uh, can I purchase these? Simple Ukrainian borscht. Interesting. Okay. Um, what is the magic wand? Is that the thing that I use to, to clean these up? Hocus Pocus. Oh my goodness gracious me. That is handy. Let's keep that nearby. Magic wand. Let's grab the cayenne pepper and let's uh, let's stick this over here as well. Alrighty. Um, let's see. Moskrug, paella pan, small pot, small skewer, a spatula. I already have one of those. Uh, can I hang my tongs up? I can hang those up. Can I hang up the tongs? I put my tongs over here. Let's hang these up, shall we? Hey, neat. Okay, that's really handy. I don't know what that is for. It looks like it's for a samurai sword or something. We got sour cream. We got the chicken broth. We have salmon fillets. We have lemons. Lemons. Lemon siete. We have onion, onions, uh, lemons, tomatoes, and potatoes. These are potatoes as well. I think these are just uh, quicker ways to grab them, I suppose. This is a single onion that I purchased for some reason. Um... Drop that. Okay, it goes right through the bin. Neat. All right, let's start the day, shall we? <whistles> Salmon and boiled potatoes. Coming right up, coming right up. All right, we need a thousand milliliters of water. And stop. Perfect. Let's Start that boil, baby. We need to add some salt. Let's figure out what that is again. Um, 20 grams of salt, 300 grams of potatoes. So 20 grams of salt. Cool. Where's my salt? I think it's right here. Yep. Okay, 20 grams of salt, and then we need 300 grams of potatoes. Okay, we'll just sit that down there for now and grab this one. These are each 150 grams, so we got it. Boop. And... Boop. Okay, let's grab our pan. Let's sit our pan down and start the heat. So for this one, we need a salmon filet. That. Sit you down. We need five milligrams of black pepper and salt. Boop. Boop. Okay. And then we need, I think it was, was it 10 milliliters of oil? Oh man. Yep, 10 milliliters of sunflower oil. Oh boy, I put way too much there. That's okay. Stick that there, and we'll set this for one minute. These are about half done. I put in so much that it says it's making a soup of some kind. Whoops. Let me double check the that. 
Add to the pan sunflower oil and the salmon filet. Okay, 60 seconds on each side. These are coming along. Let's taste. Potatoes are getting there. Thirty seconds left on this side. That's gonna be done soon. Let me take that off the heat in a minute. Um, advanced, rotate. Oh no! Oh god! Oh Jesus! Oh, shit. I, I know, I know, I know. Everything's going to hell. Oh, God. Um. Oh, dear. The, oh, no. Scoop that. Oh, sh Nikes. Okay. Be patient. Be patient. Oh, God. Uh. I know, I know, I know, I know. Okay, we flipped it. That's good enough. Hang you back up. I know. Uh, turn off that heat. Oh, God. Let's uh, take you and put you back on the fire. Oh, Lord. I, I get it. I get it. You're done. I get you. Uh, let's go ahead and go grab our plate. Oh, this is this game is difficult. <laughs> oh, man, it's hard. Definitely silly, though. That's for sure. All right. So, oh, gosh, forgetting you have to hold it. Um, OK. Um, release. Okay, and let's grab this other one. And then, uh, release. Okay. Hang you back up. How are we coming? We're almost there. It's gonna be weirdly cooked, but who, who gives a rip right now? Okay, um, advanced controls, drop. No, oh, not that. <laughs> oh my lord, it's so difficult. Okay, let's do this. Let's, uh, let's, let's sit you down for now. We gotta pour you out in a second. Okay, so spatula. We're gonna put you on there, and then we are gonna bring you gingerly over to here we are going to do a rotate okay stick you back there we're gonna bring you on over oh lordy and then uh serve it up service hey look at that much better I got a tip that time. Here's a tip. Don't eat my food. Oh God, tomato soup. Okay, so first thing I need to do is we are gonna go ahead and rotate this forward and, oh God, pour that out. Coolio. Stick you back on there because I'm sure we're gonna need you. Let's go figure out how to make a tomato soup. Chicken broth, 700 milliliters, 12 grams of salt. Okay, pour it on in. Fill. Five, six, slower down. Good enough. Sit her down. We need 12 grams of salt. What else did we need? Uh, 12 grams black pepper, six grams cayenne pepper. Six of this. And 12 of you. 
All right. What else do we need? God, I wish there's a way to make that show up on my uh, UI. Um, 960 grams of tomato, 120 grams of onion. What, 240, 360, 480, uh, 600, uh, 720, 840, and 960. So nine tomatoes, okay. Add, oh my god. Is there a, an easier way to do that? Like... They're like a basket or something. Like a box or something I can put this crap in. Nothing, huh? Okay. Well, that's a right pain in my arse. Let's do this. All right. Good Lord. This takes more time just uh, throwing this crap in here than it does uh, actually getting anything done. My goodness. All right. A lot of tomatoes. I'm sure the chicken broth would make it taste real nice, though. I wonder how accurate these recipes are. All right, and what else do we need? Uh, 120 grams of onion, boil for 60 seconds. Okay. Grab an onion, which I already have one of. I think these are 120 grams each. I mm, don't think it's gonna be boiling, but we're gonna go ahead and set this for a minute anyways, and put it down. Okay, we'll let you go. We're gonna taste you. How are we at? We're getting there. Okay, the next step is to blend and then add sour cream and pour the liquid into a deep plate, serve hot. Whoa. Deep plate. This here. I'll need my blender. Sit you down there. Oh, God. Nope. Let's just sit you over here, shall we? Um, we're going to turn this off. Taste it. How's it coming? We are not quite there yet. Because it was not boiling. <laughs> Leave that there for now. That flavor, how's that flavor coming, baby? Okay, let's turn this off. Let's blend. Oh, heck yeah. Why does the color not look right?
Okay. Um, enough. Sit you down. Bring you over to here. Um, oh, uh, um, yes, okay, cool. Oh boy, okay, that's a little bit much, and then I need to add, ah, Jesus. I'm hurrying, I'm hurrying. 150 mils of sour cream. Oh, I gotta blend that all together, whoops. <laughs> Oh boy, I am falling apart here. 150 milliliters of sour cream. Oops. <laughs> this is gonna be terrible, dude. <laughs> Order up! <laughs> it's not even the right color. Oh my lord, I can't believe they liked it. Wow. Okay, well, I got a tip, so that's something, I guess? I suppose? All right, where's my wand? I need my wand. Let's clean up a bit here. Oops. Boop. That's convenient. That's way convenient. That was well worth it. Okay, um, so the next thing that we're gonna need is we are gonna need a baking tray. Sit you down there. We're gonna grab a trout. Slap that there. We are gonna grab ourselves a limon. We are gonna try to cut this lemon, but let's season this up first. So we need dried thyme. And we need salt. Some salt. Or was it pepper? Let me double check. I think it was pepper. It was five, five uh, mils of pepper is what it was. Okay. So we need to uh, set this to bake for 90 seconds. Whoops. And set the timer, sit her down. Okay, so let's try cutting a lemon again and see how this goes. Oh boy. Chop. Chop. And... Chop. Ha ha! That's pretty good. Okay, I need a big plate. Wasabi su. And let's put these on there. Uh, drop. And drop. And drop. And drop. All right, the next thing that I need is some fresh parsley. And we're going to go ahead and... Uh, Drop you for a garnish, because you're going to be all pretty and such. And then the last thing that I have to add is some horseradish, and then I think it's good to go, if I remember correctly. Did I do it right? Yeah, I did it right. That was only two grams, though, I think. Right? Yeah, that's two grams. I need six, so... I wish I could grab more than one, and I, I feel like I'm missing something there, but... It might be part of the, uh, the, the challenge, is like you can only carry one thing at a time or whatever. Okay, we're gonna bring you over here, we're gonna sit you down, we are gonna put some horseradish on this beast! Booyah! Oops, uh, let me grab the tongs. Those tongue to tongue, tongue, tongs. 
Okay, we've got it firmly in hand. Let's go ahead and do the advanced controls. Release those tongs. Oh my god, what just happened? Where did that plate go? Come back here, you plate. <laughs> Holy crap, dude. Oh boy. Oh boy. Wait for the grasp to happen. All right. Release. And uh, we will tilt. Okay. Not what I had in mind. Still not what I had in mind. Holy crap, I'm struggling. Okay. And release tongs. Okay, cool. Let's hang these back up before I hurt somebody. Let's take the lemon. Let's drop the lemon. Let's drop them artfully on this beast. Perfect. And let's throw some parsley at it for our garnish. And service. Order up, baby. Hell yeah. That's what I'm talking about. Oh, five stars, baby. Look at that. Mmm, I am an expato. All right, then uh, why don't we clean up a bit? Let's get organized. <laughs> Let's put these back in the fridge where they belong. Or can I like leave them out? I don't know, I'm not sure. I feel like the sour cream should definitely not stay out of the fridge. But maybe, maybe I'm wrong. Um. Oops. Okay, so that's how you do it. And then you hit middle mouse. Oh, dude. The controls make a lot of sense when you start messing with it more. They're a little clunky, but they're quite fun. <laughs> Do I'm I am enjoying myself, believe it or not. Oh, can you, can you come back here, please? Go up a little, down a little. Okay, there we go. Drop. Yeah. All right. Uh, close. Beautiful. Hey, that was a day. We did it. Now let's clean this. Uh, that doesn't need cleaning. I think the bake tray does, though. Yep. It's got junk all over it. And tip it and dump that down the drain. Nice and clean. Sweet. Turn that off. Let's go ahead and hang our pan up. Can we hang the pan? Hey, look at that. Hey, LMAO. Um, big pot. Let's empty that out. <laughs> yes. We'll keep that on the stove to make sure that we know where that's at. Um, let's check out what uh, recipes we can get. Um, pork chops with baked potatoes. Duck broth. There's a lot of recipes. Um, let's do the pork chops with baked potatoes. All right, cool. Nice. Okay, so pork chops and potatoes. Awesome. That's what I'm talking about. We done. End of day. Ayo. Level up. Do I get another perk? Okay. Right, we're getting expected. It's our great chance to raise our fame. Be ready. Oh, lordy. A new decoration available. Let's choose some skills to level. Let's, uh, I'm sure we're going to need to do some uh, repairs soon. Um, derpers and gourmets have their expectations lowered. Uh, let's see.
products need 2x, 3x, 4x more time. They lose their temperature slower. Yeah, let's do that. Let's do durable equipment. Oh, and I, I get the borscht. I, I guess I don't have a choice. Okay. I mean, that's going to do it. That was almost an hour. <laughs> it's 30 minutes per day. Not too terribly bad. Um, whew, that's loud. Let's mute that for a second. So that said, thank you all so very much for joining me. Um, let's go ahead and place this on our tier list. I am going to put this... At an S, I'm not even kidding. I'm gonna put this right out of the gate. I was not expecting this to be as good as it is. It's going to S tier because it, it appeals to me in a lot of ways, especially around cooking and things like that. I think it's quite enjoyable and it doesn't seem uh, to be uh, terribly designed. It's quite fun and I'm enjoying it. So we'll put that on our S tier and uh, it should be showing up on the screen right now. Uh, congratulations, Cooking Simulator. You are the first and you are S tier. That's excellent. And that said, Thank you all for joining me. If you enjoyed this, please make sure that you hit the thumbs up and leave a comment. Those help a ton. And if you are new to the channel, please make sure you subscribe and ring that bell as much as I hate the phrase. It'll let you know every time I post a new video and uh, I'm hoping to do that more frequently. That said, thank you again for joining me and we'll see you next time here on Simcade.